Biden fellows help. Matter of fact, it's not even yet hot, is it? Six, six o'clock, holy shit. I need to lay off my monster hunter. Yeah, so, yeah. I could I could make up some excuse as like, you know, I want to see Bankai's reaction to this chapter, or her, you know, I want to get some second thoughts on this chapter, or I want to take in some comments to think about it, but I was playing Monster Hunter all day, yesterday. <laughs> I was playing Monster Hunter all day today as well. Um, <laughs> I'm having so much fucking fun with the game. Uh, I played until... I woke up at 11, I turned the game on, I took, I took, I took several breaks, mostly for food or something, that equaling about one hour, and I turned the game off at about 5 a.m. It's not good. 5 a, 5 a.m., yeah. So, I'm not tired, thankfully this is spring break, and I'm going to use it racking up hours. I had, I added 15 hours on Monster Hunter. I probably added another see, I think I started playing around 10. Which would be like another 6 hours? Shit. Okay. But anyway, on to this chapter of you. And this chapter made me realize something about this manga that I, I thought about a little, but now it's kind of confirmed. I hate this fan base. I really fucking hate this fan base. Um, mostly because they're all just a bunch of. Uh, uh. Just like. Okay, so I did. I didn't. Fa I didn't. In fact, watch Bonkai's review. Like this chap. Like, you know, before I get into that, quick synopsis. Monaco's walk. Monaco's walking around. Oh look! So she gets a message from Zenkichi. Oh look, a riddle. Where she solves the riddle. Like, oh, the party should be in here. No one's here. Like, did I do something wrong? Then she looks on the chalkboard. There's another. There's another riddle. It says, um, Zenkichi, Zenkichi plus Shiranui. No, Monaco plus Shiranui over Zenkichi equals on sh on night ninety thousand something. And she's like. Another riddle. Oh, well, clock tower. And he's like, well, you got here fast. <laughs> I mean, I don't really see the point in that, but kind of, eh, I don't know. Honestly, I honestly felt like those were kind of wasted wasted pages. Wait, just wasted pages, but... Zinkichi goes on to explain the... What was it? Oh yeah, the event, the farewell party from Nakamuk, and it's the 100 flower run. And what, es what essentially is, is Madaka has to now fight the 100 of the strongest students in in the academy. I'm like, so, to, and I'm, now after hearing this, I am convinced that this is the end, end of the manga. Because, like, I'm, I'm convinced that you have to, like, if now, if he doesn't wrap this up, like, most like, much like everyone else, I will be kind of annoyed. Shocking, I know, but even I would have to be kind of annoyed that if this wasn't the end end. So, so he said, like, we, we even invited a bunch of people outside of the, outside of the school. And, like, you see silhouettes of Neko, the Liar King, I can't. I can I can never remember, I can never remember the last part of her name. Kumagawa, you see Oido, Hinokage, who we haven't seen since the Minus Arc. Damn, we haven't seen him since the Minus Damn. And in the middle between of those guys is Oh, uh, what's his name? Ihiko. Uh Iki Ihiko silhouetted. So that's that's this and he's and he sees like fuck she's like, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. This is the most awesome lane, to, and they they start talk they start talking and Madaka I think Madaka imposed a rule on herself. I don't remember Zankichi bringing this up if I unless I misread, misread the chapter because you know Madaka is kind of wordy, but she said as a failure for as a failure if I if I fail to do this as a punishment I have to break my promise with my dad and come back and come back to Han um the school and. I think I think uh, what I got what I got from what Zinkichi said after that is just like, like, like this is like 
like, like I think he's like, you can do that if you want, but I'm not going to force you to it. And it's just like, but there's a whole lot of people who do actually want that. And he's just like, yeah, like, just like me, and just like, a, like everyone, there's this, there's this shame, shameful part of me that wants you to stay here. And so Zenki, so Zenkichi goes up to him and is like, all right, let me give you, let me give you first flower. And Madaka being the god mode suit, god mode Mary Sue that she is, bam! Honestly, did you, did you really think, like, and people call Zenkichi useless, like, this woman is fucking, this woman is like fucking god. Anshinin said she couldn't beat her. Therefore, An Anshinin is like, like, before the progenitor of progenitors. I mean, like, what the fuck are you expecting? What the hell do you expect Madaka to do to him? Speaking of which, I am expecting to see um, Anshinin come back somewhere around, around the late numbers. I am expecting to see that. If it, if it doesn't happen, because Ihiko himself said, now that my destruction came reversible, that one's going to pop up sooner or later, so, meh. Mm-hmm. How is she, how is she going to do that? Oops, sorry. Battery's getting low. How is she going to do that? Who the fuck cares? Who the fuck cares? So, and, and this re and this really was sort of a farewell, but there's one, there's one thing to really, really point out in this chapter, and... That is after, you know, she clocks him in the chin. <laughs> like she's like Thor's or something. Troll knocking. Do, 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 do. I really need to continue being in but she um she says, There uh, therefore I'm I'm really grateful, Zenkichi, for letting me drop out in this cool way. Thank you for decorating my road with flowers. Goodbye, Zenkichi. I'm glad I'm glad we were together for the New Year's. Thanks to you, I could be happy. And you know that's the page that got that kind of got me to note to notice this, but um, like, like to all you annoying fans who I don't, <laughs> we're all like up in arms about, you know, oh like this whole this whole thing's stupid. They should be together. No, the relationship is the relationship. Oh, I'm gonna say this, the relationship is fucking stupid. Like this this is a de this manga is a deconstruction of shonen stereotypes. So their relationship was never meant to be in the very start. Get that get that out of your fucking heads. Swear to God, and you do, and, and if I kind of I kind of flat and I really kind of flash back the second time I read this real quickly before doing before doing this review, back to um, back to the last chapter when she said I can't imagine my life without you and I'm just kind of like, and this and that flashback almost flashing back again all the way to like the be the very beginning of the manga where. Where Zenkichi, when Zenkichi was in still that, like, you know, his balls are tied, tied, like, in a loop, at, like, gripped by Madaka, like, at all times, and it's like, I, we can't really imagine life without her, and I'm just like, and that's the overall, overarching theme of this whole thing, so this is like, dude, you can't, you can't expect all this, you can't expect all these horse shit merry times, right, merry times that go on forever, I mean, Move on. That's the whole thing. That's the whole thing. Is like, there are times we have to move on. That was, a, that was that's been the central theme for these past three, four, five chapters. And people are simply like pissed off and was like, no, they're cha they're really And what's particularly annoying, annoying me, it's like some and especially it was like mostly was not bonk Bonkai's review. I think he was just pissed off, but it was just really retarded and was like. And she knew, and she he wanted Shirinu to go up to her, beat beat the crap out of her, saying he's mine now. I'm like. Oh, fucking stupid. That was just fucking stupid. I'm not. Mm. Okay, what kind of fucking story would that make? Oh. I, I could talk about why that's so goddamn stupid, but... Now, I'm, I'm not saying stupid because I want her to go up and just directly do that. But I can, I can kind of see that being brought up. Like, you know, if Niso actually takes his, takes his time with these chapters, because these these can go, like, since they're doing a 100 flower run, and she just took out, like, what, how many people did she just take out? Hold on. Do, 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 switch out the last page. Do, do, do. She just took out, five by five, 20, 25 more students at the end of the chapter, because they're all weaklings, and there's two, and, so it's 26, so, she can take. She could probably take out. This this could take up up to. 
I'd say 50 chapters if you, if, you know, but that would require a lot of characterization on, on, like, and characterization for, for on Nito's part, and he's not gonna do that, so. At most, I see this, this arc being 25 chapters. And, hmm. And, you know, I don't know, I'm, I'm not sure what to say, it's more, it's a wrap-up, it's about independence, and it's like, and, cool your fucking richest people. I mean, you knew, if you didn't, if once Aunt Shannon showed her fucking face, if you didn't know that you were getting to a, a serious mo show in a manga deconstruction, then, then you're an idiot. Then you're, then you're an idiot. They're going to, do, they're going to do things that you don't expect, and they're going to do things you probably don't like, and the reason you don't like them is because you've been, you've been set up by... This genre as a whole, well, genre in the U.S., demographic in Japan, more or less. That's, you know, the stories work and the stories work in this way, the happy end, blah, 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 and that's not how, that's not how it works. Even though Madaka Box breaks, can break all the rules of reality and not, while not giving a fuck, it's still about, it's still about real life things. It's still about real life things, not this happiness forever, not this will be together forever. I mean, what the fuck? What the fuck do you expect? Do you expect? Do you expect Zenkichi to just like, like even say like? Do you think like I can't just grow up that fast? I mean, eh. I mean, I mean like, like think or think about this. So your girlfriend, you really like. You're going out. Everything's going fantastically, and then she says, "I got a mod a modeling job in Paris. It'll pay. It'll pay enough." Like, it'll literally pay enough for the both of us to live there. I want you to come with me. What the hell would you say? No, I, I want you to chew on that. Honestly, what would you say? And let's, and let's, uh, and to throw it, uh, throw it in, and think he, and think he's position even more. What would you do, like, what would you do if you're in a system of power with other people? You know, are you just going to leave, leave everything behind? Like that? Like... I don't know. I'd say like manager, manager of a job, but that's not that important. <laughs> so I don't know. Just just chew on that. Madaka Madaka and Zenkichi's relationship was doomed to fail from the start. That's just like that's just effing obvious. Honestly, I mean, <sighs> I hope to God, I hope to God that. I kind of want to see the, you know, Zenkichi and Muke pairing, but that'd be just kind of weird and not and not story important. But yeah, I feel I feel I have the feels for that girl. She she's had she's had it rough. I remember, uh, on the side though, I remember seeing a meme that said, um, what was it? What was it? Oh yeah, come come here and let let the man you love reject you in the most epic way possible. It was like the alien sky. Manga. But that's roughly all I have to say on this chapter. I hate this fan base a lot, a lot, a lot. Mostly because they don't understand what they what they got into, and now they're all pissed off because like, no, I'm like, no, this is a deconstruction, and <sighs> this is a deconstruction. So it's going to like, it's a Supposed to mess with you, fuck. And the outrage from these people is just absolutely retarded. I mean, let's see. Huh? Let's read. Let's read some comments, cause you know I think I'm gonna do this at the end of, at the end of every review. Speaking, of which I need to find something new to review. Um, recommendations. Rex Pat. No, I should probably censor the names. Um, man, I really wish she would have. She would have fought Sankichi last. That's very disappointing. I can understand where he's coming from, but she's a god mode Sue. The fuck do you expect? Um, do -do 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 -do. someone likes the idea. Let's see. Like, I'll, oh, um, I like this idea. Some people may say Madoka Box is getting horrible, but still, I like this. At the same time, I'm not blindly. I'm not the one to blindly like everything about this manga. Like Zenkichi not being with the duck and Al. Doom from the start. You cannot like it, but I I say Doom from the start. I didn't I didn't like the relationship anyway. Honestly, honestly, I didn't like it anyway. Romances are kind of stupid, but... 
Um, continuing, and Zinkichi, and also I know that Zinkichi is a normal person who defeated initially, but I'm not satisfied with that one punch. One punch, one punch. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, he didn't have, he didn't have the style, I mean, eh, whatever. I mean, hmm, eh, yeah. Uh, I know he got someone's coolness back by getting a style and helping defeat Hika, but that doesn't mean you can just make him suck again. He always sucked. Sm and the small fry team is <laughs> or just a bunch of normal students who came, who came for a helping defect. They shouldn't be there. They're going to die. <laughs> They're going to die. And finally, Anchen, where are you? She better fucking show up, or else I will be mad. I'll admit that I will be mad if this if this arc manga doesn't end here, and um, and Anshin doesn't make an appearance again. I will be mad. Um, it just get better. Thank you. Another chapter of nothing. She's going to beat them. Something's going to happen. Um, she will be end up staying, returning, pulled back with Psycho Tower. Boring. Next. Okay. A another chapter of nothing. If there, if this was nothing, there'd be blank pages. She's going. She's going to beat them, obviously, because you know, on Shinin, on Shinin, literally is literally that so much so genre savvy that she is aware of Madaka's plot armor. She's the main fucking character, people. Something's going to happen. That's everything in life, you dumbass. And she'll end up staying, returning, being pulled back. I will be pissed off if that happens, actually. So they don't. So they don't end together. I'm glad I stopped reading this at the election. I've been disappointed. Oh, so got me better. Eh, whatever. So there isn't going to be time skip. Not everything needs a fucking time skip arc. Ugh. Oh my god. It's 26 now. Do, 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 do. Poor useless Nkichi. Kumagawa had better have an epic part in this. It's Kumagawa. He's going to be epic by by default. Once again, once again, damn it. Damn And once again, you could have at least been the last person to fight her. Again, I can understand that. See, I miss I miss Madaka, I miss Madaka when, when she had the long hand with wasn't so fucking ellipses underscore something something it's something and that's all that's all I can say and FFs people seriously what's the point of confessing each other when nothing's going to happen like that. It's I swear to God, I swear to God, every chapter at the end of the collection, I can hit the same one more. Stop fucking reading. Luis Lopez, I think so, I think someone's poisoned because the only reason, only reason someone would read something that they hate. Let's see, it's not about, oh, here's something, a reasonable comment. It's not about reading reading anymore or not, if you're invested in the story, no matter how lame it gets, um, you should want to finish it off for several possible reasons. Mm -hmm. mm, no, because, like, if you thought, if you thought every, at the end of election arc, that was one, two, let's see, after that was, um, wedding feast, Unknown share new than the Ihiko. Yeah, that's three arcs. If you consider if you consider three arcs of a series bad, then fucking drop it. I mean when something has like an almost equal amount of you saying you don't like it, just fucking drop just fucking drop it. If it's if it's really if it's really causing you that mu so much rage and physical anguish, then then you're just hurting yourself and you're a retard. I dropped fairy tale. Many people drop fairy tale because you know it's it's pissing them off. So why can't you just? Hmm. I can understand like you know want to be a completionist, but weigh your weigh your benefits and your rage and your all that other shit. And the last comment, is some, last comment. I hope they do not skip the one hundred fights. Seeing the Daka fight, only people will be epic. Wait, there's new fighters. I don't think so. Um. I hope they don't skip all one. I hope they don't skip um all one fights. Naturally, some of them are going to skip because you know Madaka's going to blaze right through them. But I'm expecting some end characterization from from all of them. But you know we haven't really had. But you know Madaka hasn't really been about the battles ever. I mean the most intense battles we got with was in the minus arc, and that's because you know it was just it was just one giant play off of the 
Oh, folks, just of shown of shown um, battle turn arcs, and in the and the what's the meta deconstruction arc, which which technically is this whole thing ever since the election, as at the election. But yeah, yeah. How how interesting would it be to see like Madaka, Madaka and Anshin go into like a full fledged fight? That'd be interesting. That'd be interesting. But anyway, I guess I'm not sure what this review really truly was. Um, kind of a rant, kind of a. Uh, whatever. I have, I have a Django Unchained on bootleg. I'm just gonna go watch. I'm just gonna go watch that. Finish that. Play some more Monster Hunter. Then watch a man on a man Crunchyroll. Could have could have no basketball. Digimon Tamers. Not 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 feeling the the, the urge to watch the rah 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 rah. So new something that sucks about Monster Hunter. Because of this, I now must make friends in the outside world. So nope. Since I've been watching Django Unchained on bootleg. A feeder saying. I believe that's the term. But don't worry, don't worry. I will buy, I will buy, you know, Django and Chain, hopefully in a special edition when it comes out eventually. And some other Quentin... T I remember there was this Quintal Tarantino bundle or something like that. That'd be really nice to have. I think it has Pulp Fiction in there. Fucking love that movie. You know, now that I think about it, do you, can you, could you consider Pulp Fiction like the... The in real life version of Bacchanal. Thoughts for days. Thoughts for days. Boop. Santa. And. Fuck rat. Fuck Raytheans. And Kuropekos. No, no, no. Forget the Raytheans. Just fuck the Kuropekos. The goddamn inflatable, inflatable throat thingies. <laughs> 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 